So I'm making a Jack Daniels barrel lid end table. And uh, on the insides, you know, they char the barrels for the whiskey. And it's all sooty and ashy, and it doesn't make a uh, an appealing thing to have on the, even though it's your bottom of your table. I don't like it. So, just gonna clean it off. Use a standard wire brush. Take it down, real good, and then I'll, uh, I'll use another brush to sweep it off. And let's see now, it's a lot smoother. I don't know if the light will pick it up as well, but it's just a lot better look, cleaner, everything. So now I just, uh, I take it apart because these are loose fit. You know, you, you can pry them apart. It's just uh, wooden dowels in there and they stay together under pressure because the barrels banded together. But uh, I'm gonna take it all apart, glue up all the dial pins. And I used to just leave it there, but I had a couple that bowed. So I run a strap just straight across there and then uh, I make hairpin legs and put them on it. I'm not real thrilled about the strap being there. I mask it a little bit by charring it, and then sometimes I put black paint on it, but it keeps them from bowing because these things are not cut square. You know, I don't know if you can tell or not, but they're they're tapered just a little bit. So instead of the barrel sitting like this, the top is actually concaved in. basic stuff I just put glue on the dowels and a little bit there on the edge You can see this side's pretty well all compressed together. I got one crack there, one there. That'll pull together when I get the clamps on it. But, <coughs> see the big gaps? Every one of them. It's because this thing is supposed to sit in a barrel similar to that. Not flat. So that's why I add that strap across. And I off center it two um just because i put three legs on it so i go 120 degrees from each other with the brackets these are the legs that i use i make them just a hairpin leg um but if i'm getting my 120 apart from each other i offset the uh this wood i'm gonna get this split in half and we'll get her glued into place and the clamps on it and everything all right, so I got it all clamped up. Um, I covered this board in a ton of glue and uh, just got some boards clamped on to keep them flat and same down here, I had a board wanting a bow. I'll let this sit overnight because it's super late in the shop and then 
I will put these hairpin legs on and I'll show you guys the finished product. I also still have to clean the top up. Let's clean the top side up. These things are pretty nasty. Let me clean that glue off. But these things are pretty nasty when I get them and uh, clean it up so you can see the the Jack Daniels distillery and the barrel numbers and all the other information that's on it. Those are uh, legit Jack Daniels barrels tops. So I lost the footage of cleaning and finishing the tops, but it's just a couple coats of lacquer and I sand in between each coat. So the day's done and I'm burning some of my scraps, but I just wanted to take a moment to say thank you to all of my friends, family, and customers for helping support me and motivate me and keep me going while I'm building my small business. So with that, thank all of you so very much. And if you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe button. It really means a lot to me. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you.